as someone who struggles most nights to get a good night's sleep, um, a movie like this doesn't really do much to help calm my nerves. Uh, now, I was... I liked A Nightmare on Elm Street, but I wasn't a massive fan of it. I was more of a uh, Friday the 13th fan. So, you know, Freddy Killing in Your Dreams, yeah, yeah, whatever. That didn't affect me too much. But now I'm looking at this one. And this one's called Mr. Sleep. And this comes out in a couple days, just after Easter. And, um, yeah, I'm hoping that uh, watching this doesn't uh, take away more of what little sleep I have. Yeah, that looks great already. Sleep is back. I think he wants revenge for what we did to him. He's dead. He did. Sleep is dead. Do all the Americans have big houses? We have to assume that a copycat is going to kill everyone on your face. Have you ever met anyone get away? I come back. I always come back. <laughs> but dying's such a bitch. Didn't the Chucky say that? Mr. to sleep. He's killing everyone, isn't he? You know, watching that trailer, I think I'll be all right. I don't think Mr. Sleep's going to do too much damage to me. I don't mind the look of Mr. Sleep, though. Big trench coat, ugly face. Anyway, um, the synopsis. It's very short. A deranged killer known as Mr. Sleep takes retribution on a group of insomnia patients who he believe stole his memory. So this is giving off a very clear uh, low-budget vibe. You know, to be kind of vibe. So perhaps that's where this one's going to end up. That's no disrespect to any movies that end up on Tubi. Just saying that the overall feel of this one is not something that I think I'll get super scared about, super creeped out about. But still, I the the reason I love doing these videos is because we watch these movies together, and then I then I, you know when they come out, I get pleasantly surprised or not surprised by how good they are. Um, recently watched Blur, the Australian film, and well, there's a reason I haven't done a review of it. Yeah. So, that's Mr. Sleep. Um, a, a slasher, potentially trying to go for a franchise, which is good. I don't mind horror franchises at all, as long as you know they keep to the lore. On the screen, there's an up and a down, a thumbs up and a thumbs down. Press thumbs up if you want to see it, thumbs down if you don't want to see it. I'm a bit ambivalent on this one, but I'm willing to give every horror movie a try as long as it at least looks half decent. And this does look half decent, just maybe not the brilliant thing that I'm expecting. But I don't think I'll lose any sleep over it, but I think I might in, maybe, maybe could enjoy it a little bit. I'm the Addy Dans and you're watching Shock Mania. Please press like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you want to see more first looks. Otherwise, I'll catch you next time.